guy that has the striking acumen yep. of this guy right here. And the jab is not as underutilized a weapon as it was in MMA, say, five or seven years ago, but he's got as good a jab as anyone in the business, and that is where all of his striking flows off of. We'll see how it goes for him in this matchup tonight. Well, this is exciting here, DC. The founder of Jeet Kune Do, one of the founding fathers, really, of mixed martial arts. Bruce Lee is back in a big spot here tonight. Bruce Lee is what every kid looked to when they thought about doing karate. Bruce Lee is the person that anyone looked at when they said, I want to be a fighter. It was the speed. It was the charisma. It was the approach of Bruce Lee that made him so special. And tonight, he's going to look to show a new generation of fighters. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. When the action begins, our referee in charge of the Octagon, Herb Dean. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out O2 Arena in London, England. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands 5 feet 11 inches tall, weighing in at 165 pounds. Fighting out of Las Vegas, Nevada, USA, Assassin. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands 5 feet 7 inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting out of Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon Lee! You've been giving your instruction in the dressing room? Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves is my best Fight. I'm anxious, man. What a matchup it is, and it's going to be interesting. And it's going to be interesting to see who has the upper hand early. It's going to be difficult to find out how this plays out, right? Striker versus well-rounded fighter. Who's going to be the one that's going to control where this fight takes place? Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. And he caught the kick. Beautiful kick. Some of the best kicks in the game that you'll see right there. Well, he is at his kickboxing best tonight. Another nice, good series of kicks by him there. I mean, the kicks are coming in bunches. Normally, it's the hands. Tonight, he's throwing kick after kick after kick. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Looked like he might have landed there. Instead, a swing and a miss by Lee. kick was there earlier, not there on that attempt. Big punch lands over the top. How's he going to follow this one? Nice head kick. Oh, nice job landing the knee there. He's got a lot of size for this division and put it to good use there. Oh, body kick attempt here. It's no good. Oh, man. You jumped out of your seat a little bit after that kick. Oh, I did because I have times where I've been kicked like that. And I'm going to tell you one thing. It does not feel good. Nice punch by Lee. You don't know when that leg kick's coming. Oh, here's a kick to the body. Blocked, though, by Lee.
just missed on the front kick there. I need you to pay attention. Oh, and he tags him with the straight, beautifully placed there by Lee. Well done to catch the kick. We'll see what he can do with it. He is all about that left kick to the body. Nice one, two there. Well, he's looking for that left hand. Just out of range, though, with it. Nice body kick right up the elbow. Oh, nice. Effective strike there by Lee. He's got a serious right punch, and he went to it effectively there. It is his money shot, and he will continue to throw it until he finds a knockout. Oh, nice job there to land the knee strike to the body again, making great use of his length in this matchup. Oh, an educated jab there. I could watch this dude jab all day. I mean, he's so light on his feet, and when he pops that jab, it comes right back to his face. Oh, and he lands a punch there. Good connection by him on that. Great connect. So fast, so accurate. Watch the ability to land anywhere. Splits the guard, lands the right hand. Oh, and he lands another knee there, DC. It doesn't always pay to be the taller fighter. In this instance, it most certainly did. Big body kick. Just unable to quite find that range. And he caught the kick. We'll see what he can do with it. Oh, he lands another strike to the body. Really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection. And these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Big ball punch lands. Now he gets back to range. Lands a glancing right hand upstairs. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Ten seconds to go. Lee gets caught by the straight punch. Big kick. Uh, uh. All right, that horn signifies the end of the round. Let's take us through some replays, champ. And the replays are going to be kicks. That's the story of this fight to this point. He is landing these kicks at will, just driving his shin into his opponent's legs, and it's really starting to slow him down. All right, DC, buckle up. Here we go with our next round. High number of kicks landed in the previous round, and he'll look to keep it going here. He'll look to keep winning the fight with this kick. He's throwing eye kick, leg kick, body kick. He's even throwing a couple spin kicks in there. This guy is so educated with fighting with his legs. Man, he just keeps on coming with these shots to the liver, looking to buckle him once again. Got him down to his knee earlier in the fight with a liver shot. He knows he's hurt there, and he'll continue to target that area. Good strategy. That's a big strike right there. That right hand hurt him a little bit. Oh, man, this guy kicks like a mule. So hard. He kicks so hard every time you see him drive his shit into his opponent. Oh, nice counter to land the left hook there. That punch, no good. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. And both guys really throwing with authority. Wow, he lands another. How's his opponent still stand? I mean, I have no idea. This fight is supposed to be over. And it might not be over now, but it's got to be over very soon. Yes, they heard him in the last round. Same exact one. Beautiful strike.
Nice one-two there. Just out of range with that kick attempt. Oh, wicked nice leg kick there, DC. Can't take too many of those. It's very tricky when he throws that body kick. You got to whip his hip into that kick. single collar tie. So a much different approach for him here in this second round. He was a little bit tentative in round one, a little bit of a feeling out process. Now he has clearly found his rhythm, found the range. We'll see if he can continue with more activity here in round two. Right hand punch to the clinch. Oh, and he caught the kick. And they separate. Nice kick. Right under the elbow, the body kick lands. And now they are throwing both sides with conviction. Oh, huge block. Nice punch lands over the top. Lee gets hit by that leg kick. You may want to start checking some of these. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Nice kick. Ooh, head kick lands. He's hurt. Oh, high-level defense there. The hook shot is blocked by Lee. You can really limit the mobility of your opponent with those leg kicks. Oh, and he connects there. His hands look good to him. So fast. I mean, this guy has tremendous hand speed. Trying to double up on that jab. Oh, and there's a land with the kick, so certainly a good... His opponent in a world of trouble. Such a sneaky head kick. He did not recognize it. He's coming high, and now he's got him hurt bad. All right, he closes the distance, gets the single collar tie. Right hand punch from the clinch. Oh, he just continues to pour it on. He has been aggressive all night long with his striking. Got to be careful here to not empty the gas tank. So far, so good, though, in this round. Lands the left punch now, followed by a right. Beautifully placed in time kick there by Lee. Tried to go to the body, but unable to connect. I mean, he's cutting him down the size with these beautiful leg kicks. Oh, big punch land. And that's the end of round number two. All right, there's the horn indicating the end of the round. So potentially a big factor here, ladies and gentlemen. The cut on the cheek sustained in that round. Certainly better to be below than above the eye, but the cut man's got to get in there and close that thing up. All right, so there's the horn signifying the end of the round. A stunner there with the head strike midway through. Nearly got him out of there for good. Almost got him out of there. He hurt him badly. He had his opponent hurt real bad. Now his opponent's walking back to his corner. Everybody looks confused. They don't know what they're supposed to do to try to change the way that this fight is going. Third round underway. Well, he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. He continues to connect on a high volume of strikes here. Great punch. Nice head kick. Blocks that kick to the body. Liver kick. All oh, right, then a left. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Oh, there he goes, attacking that lead leg to the outside. Nasty kick there. Nasty leg kick. You gotta slow down your opponent. He knew his opponent wanted to move a lot tonight. This is the first step in getting him to slow down and fight at your pace. Well, you didn't see a lot of the body work from him in the earlier rounds, but he's certainly getting after it here. Big shot to the body connects there. We'll see if he can follow it up. 
Oh, Superman punch. Not always easy to execute. He did so there. Effective punch there by Lee. Back and forth we go here. Punches blocked. Oh, nice kick right there. Tell the masses how how good that feels to get kicked like that. John, it doesn't. <laughs> it doesn't feel good to get kicked like that. Just over three minutes to go in round three. Straight punch land. Oh, he missed with that right hand. Well, this is exactly the sense of urgency you're looking for. Try to take the judges out of it. He is lighting them up now. Look at the whip action that comes from this throw that kick. Just misses with the jab. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Unable to connect with the right hand there. Oh, nice connection there with the punch, DC. Great timing to land that punch. He's gotta be careful dipping his head when he's throwing that jab. Nice leg kick. So a combination of kicks from him, and most of those found the target, DC. The kickboxing is on point tonight. He's so sharp, and he feels so good that he's throwing multiple kicks in a row. Beautiful body kick. Real quick leg kick. Connects there with the punch. And both fighters exchange in the pocket. Big head kick lands. Man, the body work really starting to take its toll here. Obvious redness on that right side. Ooh, what a head kick. Well, if you're gonna leave your body that wide open, you're gonna pay the price, and he certainly did there as his opponent lands flush to the midsection. All right, he engages in a single collar tie here. He has a commitment to kicking tonight, and it shows. Going back to his patented kicks here, but unable to find the target there. Oh, you gotta like the output here. So aggressive with the strikes, he continues to light him up. Got to be careful here not to gas out, of course, but you got to like the offense we're seeing from him, especially in this round. 20 seconds now remain in the round. Real sneaky head kick gets in there. Final seconds of round three. Big kick. Well, lands a good series of kicks there, DC. It really didn't take him long to get a good beat on his opponent. He figured the timing, and now he's been driving kick after kick into his opponent. All right, a lot of high-level highlights from that last round, DC. Take us through the replay. If he fought like this, I would be comfortable entering him into a K-1-level right? kickboxing competition. He's that good at finding and landing those kicks at will. He needs to continue to do this as the fight goes on. Nice work, guys. All right, next round is underway, DC. We talked about his powerful kicks, how he attacks all sides of the body, the head, the legs. Pretty good start for him tonight. That was so impressive to see someone fight almost predominantly with their legs and have that level of success. Look at the turnover in that kick. Nice counter left there. Oh, Chris boxing here. The right punch followed immediately up by a left. Huge block there. 
Well, just as he did the previous round, continuing to land a high number of strikes here, and he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down. Scary, scary proposition for the opponent. That knee to the midsection. Got to think his opponent's going to feel that one in the morning. And he's going to continue to throw that strike because he knows that his opponent can't take many of them. Well, at this point of the fight, he is way up on the judges' scorecards. And from a stamina standpoint, he looks like he can fight all night. He does a fantastic job of fighting at a great pace, but also knowing exactly where to preserve and well, to conserve the energy. And it's showing when you look at his gas tank, and it seems as though it's still full. All right, well, he's landed some good shots tonight, but there's no three-piece, there's no soda. More often than not, it's one and done. He's not even getting a combination. I mean, <laughs> if you're gonna sit there at the drive-thru, <laughs> order a combination, take the soda with your food, give him the right hand behind the jab, give him the hook behind the right hand. Jab, right hand, hook, that's two pieces of chicken and a biscuit. Finish him off with the uppercut. That is your soda. I mean, come on, man, let this guy have the whole thing. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. All right, less than three minutes to go here in round four. Let's get those hands going now. Ooh, big shot lands. Oh, big roundhouse attempt just misses. Spinning back fist. Oh, that's not what you're looking for defensively. He moved right into that hook, and his opponent wisely lands it to the body there. He has been increasingly more susceptible to that strike. Let's see if that one gets his attention. And they separate. Telegraph that spinning back fist. Big kick lands. Whiffs on the right hand. The one-two punch is true. Again, going back to the jab just out of range. Big leg kick land. Now he's got the Muay Thai plug. I mean, look at the commitment to kicking in this fight. Look at him drive his shin into the whole body with that body kick. Just misses there with the left. Man, he's timed his shots nicely. It's like Tom Brady out there. He hasn't missed the target. I mean, you insist on bringing in Tom Brady. Stop it. John, stop it. Big punch lands through the middle. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Blocks the shot. All right, less than a minute here to go in our fourth round. Got clip with the right hand. Beautiful body kick. Lee gets caught with that punch. Got to shore up the defense here. Nice knee to the body, very nice. He understands that doing the body work will pay dividends the longer the fight goes. Head kick. All right, 20 seconds to go in the round. Able to check that kick as well. 10 seconds to go in round four. There's no tell on that leg kick. Buzzer sounds for the end of round four. All right, so there's the end of the round. You see the blood trickling down as he makes his way back to the stool. Cut on the bridge of the nose, or so it appears from the strike in that round. Cut man getting right to work. All right, let's take a look back at some of the replays, DC. And if you like the kicking game, that was the round for you. Yeah, man, he used his kicks beautifully. He managed distance, managed space. And eventually those kicks started to really take an effect on his opponent and slow him down. He has to stay the course next round.
All right, we'll see how it goes here in this Great next fight. round. A high Great. number of kicks landed there in the previous round, and at some point, these are going to really start to take effect. They do start to take an effect whenever you're taking kick after kick after kick, and watching him fight with that knowledge and that patience shows his fight IQ. Oh, nice punch there by Lee. Over and over, he landed these big body kicks. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. Oh, no way, spinning back fist. Nice counter shot there. And now he's got that tight punch. Lee gets hit by that leg kick. Caught that kick there. Pinpoint accuracy on that kick. No wind up, no tell, just a brutal kick. Beautiful technique on the straight right hand. Oh, and he caught the kick. And now he engages in a Muay Thai clinch, and I think a lot of people watching wonder how you can control an opponent like that. Hard to get out of. It's very difficult to get out of. Look and notice how tight his elbows are as he's maneuvering and moving his opponent into positions where he can get off the strikes. Can't take many of those, you better check. Everything works off of the jab, doubles up on it there. Just over three minutes now to go in the fight. All right, so a good job defensively by him here as he raises the guard and prevents any... Whoa! There's a huge shot there, DC. I'm not sure how he stayed up there. I mean, when you get hit with a shot like that, to stay standing shows and talks to your toughness. Big kick lands. Oh, massive head kick there. We'll see if he can finish. Still unable to find that precise range with the high kick. Well, he put so much stock into this fight, and now we're late in the game, and if he doesn't get a finish, this opportunity goes by the board. I mean, it's almost over. Right now, he's got to start doing everything he can find at his opponent and hope that he can force a mistake and overwhelm his opponent to try to get a finish. Under two minutes now to go in the fight. Trying to do damage now with the kick. That's a miss. Man, look at his torso. That just can't feel good. Look at the size of that bruise on his body, and you gotta think his opponent is gonna continue to attack that area. Big kick lands. It almost looked like he went limp there for a second. Oh, nice punch there by Lee. They continue to exchange. Whoa! He's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Oh, oh. Big roundhouse now just misses. Oh, straight right. Nice straight punch. Powerful leg kick lands. Nice head kick. He is not seeing those head kicks as the opponent's foot leaves the canvas. Oh, significant strike attempt there, but a huge block. And a nice jab there, champ. The jab was a lost art in mixed martial arts. Guys have found it, and they are fighting behind it real well. There's no give on that leg kick. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Oh, 
that's a nice strike. What a fight! Official decision now in. The buff has it. Ladies and gentlemen, after five rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. All three judges score this contest. 29-26. Declaring the winner by unanimous decision, Bruce the Dragon Lee!